Okay, so since I showed you that really old uh, spectrometer, I just want to show you some of the, the other ones we actually do, do use. Uh, this one um, works in the same way. Uh, the light comes in through here, and it goes to that little slit so that you can uh, separate out the, the, uh, the images. And then there's, um, this one has a diffraction grating in there, and that does the same thing as the, uh, the prism, except it does a little bit better job and spreads it out. So in this case, you point this end at the, at the source. I have a, uh, a gas discharge tube right here. And then you can measure the angle right here. There, there's an angle indicator for where you see the different lines. And so you can get much higher resolution for the uh, spectrum in this case. This is another really nice one. Um, if you look right here, it has also has a slit, adjustable slit actually, and so you can change how much light you let in. The more light you let in, the brighter it is, but the, the broader the spectrum is so that if you have lines right close to each other, you couldn't really see them, so you'd have to make an adjustment right here. This is a scale. Um, light comes in through here and illuminates the scale, and if you look right here, so light comes in through the uh, adjustable slit and then the grating, the image appears over here in front of the, uh, the scale too. So when you look through that, you don't have to turn, you can just read the measurements off of the scale on there. So those are two more modern ones that uh, I just wanted to show you, ones that, that we, we would use in a class.